All right, guys, what's going on? Got Tyler Ray back in the building. Today, we're going to go through a full upper body kettlebell and lower body mobility session. So follow along, enjoy, let's do this. Good, abs tight, abs tight. Yeah, there you go. When you're trying to isolate the joint, the goal is to make sure everything else that's surrounding that joint stays stable. So that way, nothing else moves. So just here, boom. Boom, you feel it in your glute, right? You shouldn't feel it too much here. Should be more here. So kick your leg back a little bit to me. Yeah, feel the difference? All right, now keep your abs on. And when you lock your abs in, you won't feel it in your back. If your abs are loose, well, it's gonna happen. You're gonna crunch to the back and you'll feel it in your QL. All the way around, big circle. Just give me five. It's very fucking boring, but let's just get it. Oh, see, well, look what's going on right now. You see this? See how this is moving? Lock this down, nothing moves here. Right? You gotta disassociate the ankle from the knee. Yep. Keep squeezing. Keep squeezing. Yeah. See? So nothing moves. Go ahead. See the difference? Once you have control of each joint, now you can move it globally. But we gotta be able to isolate before we integrate. And you should all feel it. You should feel it in your tibialis, like all the muscles here. If you isolate it, you know you gotta use those muscles as opposed to just you know, going through the motions. My goal is to get them legs bigger. If you can gain some weight in your legs, you just can't gain no more weight in your upper body. That shit's over. It's over. Top heavy. <laughs> I don't want to say it. At least you said it. Good. Keep driving the knee down. There you go. Hold it at the top. Hold. Good. Back down. Good. Shift. Good. Good. Couple more. Good, one more right here. Reach back, obviously arms up, right? You've done this plenty of times before, so we're gonna reach it, chest tall, hold position on this one, right? And then stick it, and then just hold in this position, all right? Come back slow. Keep yourself in line, right? Try to go back, when you go back, try to make sure like your leg is almost right behind the other. Right, we're not out here. Good balance, good balance, good balance. Good, stick, that's it, right there, that's it. Hold that position. Go ahead and stick. Good. So AB duck, press up, bring it back down. This is gonna, we're gonna go light, right? Give me about 10 reps. Sit it in your hand, not like this. Get in that corner, act like you're punching straight up. So I'm gonna punch it and then bring it back inside. Leave it here, right? Don't have it here. Don't Definitely don't have it here. Keep it in the front rack, we rotate it out, all right? Punch. Good, punch it up a little bit sooner. So right from there. There you go, good. Do it again, right from there. That's it, abs tight. Good, get your hand off your thigh. Good, keep it tight, keep it tight. There you go, nothing else moves. There you go, good. Keep the obliques on. Now you're firing up the obliques, right? Maintaining stability as you press. Good, that's it, lock in. Working the hip flexors on these two. Come on now, you should feel it here too, right? When you're pressing, because you don't want to rotate, so maintain that position. Two, that's it, good, nothing moves. The arm just going up, good, bring it back in, bring it back in, there you go, right there. Good, punch it, come on. Tricep, good, back in, relax. All the way around, see how you're moving your head around? Control it a little bit more, so bring it away from your body more. There you go, now bring it up, yeah. There you go, good. Full range of motion, try to bring it behind you a little bit more, keep your elbows in tighter. There you go, that's it, that's it, that's it. Good. You should be feeling your hip flexors turn on now. All the way around. Good. Back around. Let's go. Good. All the way behind. All the way behind the head. Behind the head. Big extension. All right. Think about range of motion here. Right? Because you're stretching too. So you got stability and mobility. Remember when I used to say proximal stiffness with distal mobility and distal movement? Right? This is what we're doing. So everything's locked in place here while you're being mobile outside. When you throw your strikes, everything's locked in and I'm able to just throw. See what I'm saying? But if this isn't stable, you can't do anything outside with good force and good velocity. I told you, man, if I'm going to do something, you're going to have a gorilla upper back and some motherfucking hamstrings. We're building a battleship. Ain't no rowboats over here, you know? No canoes. I want you to be able to be powerful, be strong, but also protect yourself. And people grab onto you or you grab onto somebody, they're like, damn. And they already doing that now. Imagine we keep this shit going and really start to focus in on what we need to. Boom. Switch. Boom. Boom. Chest up. Good. 
Off the ground. Good. Come on. Pull. Yeah. Come on. Pull. Good. Pull. Good. Switch it. Pull. Good. That's one. Pull. Two. Good. Let's go. Pull. Three. Alright, focus on rotation, not about the pull. Alright, row up, hold that position, and then give me rotation at the end. So hold it right here. Hold it right here. Elbow. Good. Now rotate your body. Good. Now bring it back down, but keep it up. Keep it up though. Don't bring it down. Yep, keep it there. Now rotate your body. Mm-hmm. Bring it back down. Go. Now rotate again. Good. Push into the ball. Good. Now rotate. Good. That's it. Go. Get 10. Good. Stay strong. Adductors on. Come on. Don't do this. Don't let nothing move here, right? This stays stable. Everything's locked in here. Nothing moves. And that, as you go to rotate, you're pushing the ball down, and like a bow and arrow, we're opening up. Get it, get it, get it. Pull. Keep the elbow high. Three rounds. Good. Look up at it. Look up at it. Bring your feet in. I want you to use your hip. Turn your turn your toes this way and load the hip going that way. Yeah, there you go. That's it. Good. Come on. Shift the hip. Shift the hip. Good. Come on. Good. Keep your abs on. Good. Give me a little bit more rotation of the kettlebell. Come up. There. Open. Bring it back down. Good. Load the hip. Good. Chest up. Chest up. Chest up. Chest up. Good. Turn around. Good. Bring it back. Abs tight. Abs tight. Come on. Upright, stay upright, stay upright, stay upright. Come on. Keep it going, keep it going. All the way, all the way, get to the white line. Posture, posture. There you go. Good, bring it home. Stand tall, stand tall, stand tall. Good. Keep it going, keep it going. Keep it up. Right there, and punch it this way. There you go, now bring it to the chest, and bring it up. Good, try not to move your shoulders, keep your shoulders here. There, good, punch, good. Come on. Good, more at the angle. More at the angle, there you go, come on. Good, get 10. Good, abs tight, abs tight. Good, come on. Keep shoulder square, shoulder square. Nice. Damn, I thought you did it with the rest. Oh. You should feel that everywhere. Forearm, shoulders, right? Alright, so that's a wrap. Tyler Ray, where's the Instagram at? Wolverine underscore 170. So if you have been following me for a while, you know this young man. So make sure you go ahead and follow him. If you want to train this particular actual exercise and workouts that he's been doing here today, check out Combat Kettlebell. It's down in the link in the description. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification, hit the like button. I know you like this video. You wanna go ahead? You got you got you got enough energy? You got energy. Yeah, yeah. Punch her out. Peace. <laughs> Bing.
<laughs> Alright guys, thanks for watching the video. Battle tested, my post-workout recovery training supplement is now available. Link is in the description. Again, this is all the formulations that I put together in one bottle to make you recover so that you can train harder and progress going further. Alright, check it out. Link is down below.